Get your vibration laden for the Virgo Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. This is the last week of May. The week begins from the 28 until the 3rd of June. This is the week number 20, 22. Um, so please be careful. It is all about dualities in this week. I want to say to each and every one listen to the monthly reading because the monthly readings are already posted listen to also the general readings because there will be information that is coming out okay um thank you so much for your support and your like and shares i love you virgos um please remember to listen to your sun moon and rising sign this week is the week of the lovers water with the zodiac energy of hair on Monday you have the energy of the nine of Pentacles this is wonderful for you guys you're receiving money on Tuesday the energy of the Sun isn't this wonderful you Virgos and then you have the energy of justice coming in Wow okay and um, this is wonderful and um, the week begins very very positive for you guys Friday energy of I love this card when it's in reverse that means whatever worries that you have is no longer there then we have the eye princess um, your guided angels are coming in to guide you and to help you and you have the energy of inner strength but um, the weekend is um, water and fire there's an art break or a loss in um, this week for some people heartbreak or a loss in this week no it's a queen of swords sorry the energy of the queen of swords comes in so some of you are going to be having a situation with a queen of swords stand your grounds with her whether it's a man or a woman stand your grounds with this person okay I'm giving you this message stand your ground with this person so as we look at your week is a wonderful week the energy of gains with money and the energy of the Sun is a positive energies and um, if you had a lawsuit or that sort of a thing you are going to win big time because the energy of the Sun is right beside the energy of justice so this is going to be good now this win can be a win that you're going to think you know this is a lesson that I should never ever forget so remember that now Friday to Sunday is a kind of a weird week but let's see what is going to be coming up this is a wonderful energy you have the eight of Pentacles four of Pentacles a strong stable foundation with your money and this is to see because you have the energy of the nine of Pentacles and the Sun beside each other with the four of Pentacles that means you're holding on to what you have and you have all right to do that um, the energy of the ten of swords whatever lies that was told over thank you justice came in you have won the lawsuit okay then you have the energy of the six of Pentacles help is going to be coming in and um, it can be that your spirit guides is going to be aligning you with inner knowledge and wisdom but it can also be someone a mentor that is going to be coming up and it's going to be helping you to move forward then we have the energy of um, the three of cups a celebration so this is wonderful because um, whatever this celebration is it's a positive celebration because some of you are going to be um, winning the lawsuit and that could be bringing you a lot of money or some of you could be um, just whatever um, the situation was that you guys have with either the queen of, of, of swords or and this is someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a, um, a Libran you are going to overcome this you are going to win this situation and win it big time so obviously some of you had to deal with someone that was an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra and you have win this situation big time it has to do with these two persons 
some of you maybe had to deal with and um, someone a lady uh, and, and, and this is a situation with someone who is the lady is over the age of 40 and the man is under the age of 40 could be under the age of 45 and that sort of a thing or that but these two people have gone against you to do something of injustice and you have overcome this and they are going to see the other sword the other um, yeah the other side of the sword of justice okay because of what they have done and this is good because whoever these people were they have done something in justice so some of you could be winning a lawsuit that has to do with the queen of um, an, an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libran and some of you could be winning a lawsuit um, from um, the um, someone between the ages of 20 uh, a, yeah 25 and 45 that is an Aries a Leo or a Sagi okay for some of you you had to fight against these two people and you have win and there is going to be money coming to some of you and some of you there is going to be a justice situation whoever this queen of swords whoever it is and um, an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libran whoever this person is you know there is a surprise that is coming in and this surprise is going to be the lawsuit the winning of the lawsuit and um, and money coming in unexpectedly and this is going to be good for you um, Virgos okay so this is a wonderful reading the major arcana um, justice balancing the scale is 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 here um, the energy of the nine of Pentacles money whatever is happening money is going to be coming to you guys because and uh, you know a lot of money and it depends on um, if you and this is for the people who have a lawsuit or um, have something that of injustice that is done to you this is going to be corrected and a surprise is here for you guys so I am really really loving your week it is a positive week and um, some of you are going to get some intuition over someone who is and, and this could be your daughter some of you if you have someone that is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libran you could be receiving information about this person you you could be seeing um, that you have to really have inner strength to deal with this person because whenever as you know whenever these people are in the reverse form that means they're working on their lower energies so you have to find the inner strength to deal with this person we're working with the angels of abundancy and you guys get focus on your priority and this is a wonderful energies so for you guys the, the angels of abundance saying focus on your priority focus on only the things that you want to manifest not on the things that yeah how am I going to do this no you're going to focus on the things that are going to be helping you and not on the rest not on what is going on um, outside you're going to focus on what is happening for you so this is going to be wonderful and a very very positive okay so surprising good news is coming to you guys and this is going to be extremely positive whatever the situation is whatever that is affecting your life at this moment um, there is going to be a positive outcome so I want to say to you guys it's a week of duality be careful what you do namaste until next week